one, two. Cutting with kids. My name is Kalia. And mine is Andrew. Today we're in Mark of Education Edition. So we're in Python 101 Lesson 9. So first we're going to talk to the CEO. So the CEO says, we are trying to develop a game. The game is called Age Invader, so it's like Space Invaders. The idea is that you need to move the agent so it shoots the gold box and gets points. However, we have been having problems with the different game mechanics. Can you help us? So we're going to help the CEO build a game called Age Invader, where instead of ships, there's the agent and the enemies are gold blocks. So first we're going to talk to the game developer. So the game developer says, I need to get the agent to move left or right depending on which color the player stands on. Red should be for right and blue should be for left. But for some reason they're switching my code. Could you write your own code to help me for my problem? So we're going to help the game developer with controls of the agent. So that's like a TV, and then there's a wire to the controls. Okay. So we're gonna help. Right, red is for right, and blue is for left. Okay. So first, we're gonna declare a function. So we're gonna do def move. So it's a function. Then, if blocks dot test for block, so it's testing for a block, light blue concrete, position 0, negative 1, 0, and then here. So we're testing for light blue concrete, because this is light blue concrete, and when you step on it, this like the controller, so we want the agent to go left. Okay, then we're going to make the agent move right. Agent, agent dot move left one. So we want the agent to move left because blue is for left, red is for right. Okay. Then next we're gonna do elif. Else if blocks dot test for block and do red concrete because. Instead of blue, light blue concrete, we're going to do red concrete. Okay, then position 0, 0, negative 1. Then we will make the agent move right. Agent, agent dot move right one time. Agent. Okay, so we have completed the function here. Then here, we're going to do a while true loop. So while true, we're going to call the function. So move. So then we can keep moving the agent. So now we're in round. Okay. Let's go blue. So we go the opposite direction. So we're going to change the left and right. right. And right with the left. So we actually completed it. We're gonna try one more time. Okay. Right. And left. Okay. It's so fast. Yeah. It? <laughs> it needs to swing his arms. Okay. Next, we're gonna talk to the programmer. So the programmer says, "I need to develop the firing mechanics of the game. The agent needs to shoot firework rockets into the blocks and replace them with air." But my code is not working, uh, and I do not know why. Could you write some code to help me? So we're gonna help the programmer make the age of fire, firework, fireworks instead of instead of bullets in the regular game, and it's gonna be shooting at four blocks. Okay. So here we're gonna do another function called def fire because this function allows the agent to fire the fireworks. Then we're going to do if blocks dot test for block gold block positions dot add agent dot get position position zero two zero. So here if so it'll try to test for the block gold block two blocks above the agent so we can detect the gold blocks and shoot the firework rockets. So get the position two blocks above. So try to detect a gold block. Then if it does attack the gold block, it will mobs that spawn firework rockets, so it shoot fireworks 
at the agent.get position, which is two blocks of open. Then we're going to pause for 100 milliseconds. So we do loop stuff pause 100. So the agent doesn't like keep. Oh, like it's going to be spamming. Like, yeah, spamming the firework rockets. So there'll be actual bunches of fireworks. Like a firework day, but much more. Yeah. Then we're going to do blocks.place air positions that add agent dot get position position zero to zero. So after we shoot the fire rockets, after we wait, we're going to replace the gold block with air. So the, so we basically destroyed the gold block. Okay. And here down here, we're going to run the function fire in the wall true. Okay. So now we're going to run. Okay. So we shot the firework rock rocket at the first gold block, and the gold block disappeared. Now let's move. Well, Yay! I want to do the next one. Okay. Whee. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Next. Last one. Yeah. Yeah. Sometimes the rocket gets stuck at underneath the block. Okay. Go to part two. Okay. Part Ooh, two. Now, this is a short one. Yeah. Okay. So now there are two layers of blocks. So there's one higher level instead of just one. One. Um. Okay. So up here, we're gonna do. We're gonna do elif and the fire function. Elif blocks dot test for block gold block. So it's the same as the if body position is zero three zero. So there'll be three blocks above the edges, so you can shoot farther. Then we're mm, gonna do mob dot spawn firework rockets at agent dot get position. So we'll shoot a firework rocket again, and then we'll pause for 100 milliseconds. So it's just like the last code, but you change the position. Yeah, so we can shoot one block higher. Then blocks not place air, so we replace it with air. So then we're gonna run it. So, so now I shot the second block too. It, I thought it was like I thought first just one rocket it would disappear to both like both of them. But this is a tech boop. Okay. Next. Oops. Boop. It's coming out of his head. Maybe there's like in a head there's like a lot of fireworks inside it and then they'll shoot. Boop. Like Boop. the um, machines in July 4th. Mm. Okay. Last block. Yay. It looks us up. It looks like it looks at us and it's, it's like <laughs> when I look at it, it's like, did it do well, boss? It will mm. say. Okay. So, so lastly, we're going to talk to the game developer. So the game developer says, I'm trying to develop the scoring system for the game as well as the splash screens at the start and the end of the gaming session. But for some reason, it is not working. Could you write some code to help me with my problem? So I'm going to help the game developer with the splash screens at the start and the end and the scoring. So now, yeah. here you can see there are more blocks. And there is diamond block. You can't break the diamond box. Okay. So first, in the fire function... We're going to do global score, so we're going to make the score variable global, so you can use it everywhere. Then after, we're going to do score plus equals one, so we're going to add one to the variable score. So here, what it does is that if you, it, the agent detects a gold block two blocks above it, it will spawn fireworks, pause, and replace it with air. So there's a score when you, when you do destroy a gold block or destroy a ship, you get a score, so here it'll add one score. If it can't, if it, if it doesn't detect a gold block, two blocks above it, it'll go to elf, which is three blocks, and then after all this, we're going to do, uh, add one to score again, because you also destroy one. So, and then here, we're going to do splash screens, so we're going to do gameplay.title, mods.target nearest player, so we're the nearest player, we're the only player, and then it will do the title Agent Invaders start. And then we're also gonna here while true, we're gonna, we're gonna delete the true and do while while score is less or equal to fifteen. Okay. 
Okay. Then I'll do. Yeah, okay. Do then call the functions. It'll do gameplay dot title mods dot target nearest player. It'll do congratulations you win after we finish the game. And then we're gonna do mods dot spawn lightning ball at agent position. So we're gonna lightning ball the agent. And the agent will say, "No we felt sorry, yeah. boss." Okay, now I'm right. Okay, let's play. Dun, dun, dun. So there's agent star. and ready star. So now there's okay, lots of fireworks. No, I'm gonna play one round. Then you play. Okay. Okay, agent. Yay! Oh, we need to go down. Oh, it's going down, down fast. So here Too you fast. can't destroy the diamond blocks. Look. It doesn't detect it because we don't have any. Because code. we need to detect the glow. Yeah. Go block only. Okay. Okay, one more. Last one. Yay! Look at the oh, lightning. Oh, 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 oh. The agent got a little on fire, I saw. Or was it the. Yay! More rockets. Was it that the That was one? so weird. It was like. Phew! Phew! After a lot of. Phew! Then. Phew! At the end. Okay, now to the elevator. And. Yeah. Back to the CEO. And okay. the Steve and the skeletons with the red glass that is actually the bullet for the C Steve head shooting at all those skeletons. Yeah. Heads. Hopefully the Steve head doesn't die. Okay, well, well that was fun. And that's it for today. Thank you for watching. Remember to smash the like button and subscribe. Bye bye.